Now we're going to look at um, creating freeway switch in Revit 2017. Now first I already placed a number of light fixtures in this room and because this room, this instruction room have two doors so it would be very likely that we could use a freeway switch system uh, by the door. So I'm going to click on the freeway switch from the library. Uh, from the project browser under family light lighting device, we have M lighting switch and we have a freeway switch in here. So I'm just going to drag this out and place it on the wall here. Place one here. And we'll place another one here by the door. Now to associate a light switch or creating a light switch circuit, we're going to click on one of these light fixtures. Then we click on switch. And we're going to pick, pick the command select switch and we're going to select this switch. Now you can see that's a dash line associating this switch circuit with the light fixtures. And afterward, this switch system is selected so we can go and uh, select edit switch system. And now we can click on add to system, make sure this is highlighted. And we're going to add the other light fixtures. And if we try to select the yellow freeway switch, you can't. And if we try to select select switch in here, and we, we are allowed to select this switch by clicking switch, we are disassociating the other switch with this switch circuit. So we can only select one light switch uh, per switch circuit. So at this point in time, Revit 2017 do not have a provision to include two light switch in a switch circuit. So the only thing we can do is to use a wire diagram to show that these two switch is linked in the same switch circuit um, so that it will be uh, connected properly. So I'm gonna click on finish editing system. And I'm gonna go to system and select wire. And I'm gonna use select art wire. I'm gonna pick this Connection point on the switch, pick a point out here, and pick this connection point. I'm going to pick another point here and pick the connection of these light fixtures. Oops, I'm going to have to do this again. I'm going to highlight this and I'm just going to delete this wire and do it again. So, wire, hard wire, from the connection point, midpoint, and then the connection point of these light fixtures. I'm going to click another connection point, an outside point, and click on the connection point of these fixtures again. Do the same thing. I'm going to click on this light fixtures connection point and then click on this point and then connect it back to this switch. So we can use wire diagram to show that this is a freeway switch and all the light fixture that is connected to it. Now if you want to check to see which light switch is controlling these light fixture based on the project database, all you need to do is just put your mouse over this light switch highlight the light switch, but don't click on it yet, and then use the tab key. You'll highlight the wire in the first tab. If I click on the tab key again, it will identify the light fixture that is controlled by this switch. If I go over here and highlight this switch, if I to tab, first I will highlight the wire system, and if I tab again, it doesn't show that there's any light fixtures connected to this switch. So this is the the state of these uh, software, Revit 2017, it doesn't have provision for uh, 
uh, allowing two light switch to associate with the switch circuit at this time. 